that time when you've just moved to the city? And you take the first apartment you find on Craigslist with some dude you never expected? That's where my story begins. The door was unlocked! Oh my god, you still banging that demon shit? I thought someone was getting murdered in here last night. Yeah, yeah, Callie has some hostility issues. Oh, you think? My friend Ray chewed off a guy's ball bag once, and that whole process was less noisy. Would you mind uh, unhinging the bedpost, please? I can get somebody out there Friday between 9 and uh, 9. Can you narrow that time frame a little? Buddy, I got zombies putting arms through doors all over Manhattan. Take it or leave it. Friday? What part of Friday is African dance class do you not get? Randall and I were in the same boat as far as women went. He'd gone zombie a few months back for all the wrong reasons. I really like you, but I kind of only date zombies, so... Sorry, I'm just really into warlocks now. Never make life decisions with a hard-on and a fifth of tequila. Crap. What do you got going on today? Thought I'd stare blankly ahead with cold, dead eyes for a while, how I do. Maybe check out Kung Fu Panda. Oh, by the way, this thing that you got going with Callie, it's none of my business. But? It's just that I wouldn't touch her with my cock, and it's dead, so. You have a little, uh... Milk? A little bit of, of milk, probably. No, it's skin. Did I get it? Yeah, you're good. He was right, of course. Sleeping with the boss, never a great idea. In my defense, she's hot, and our parts match up. That's rarer than you'd think in this city. Things are pretty hairy in Soho with continued congestion due to the Yeti Convention. Avoid Midtown as well, which is still backed up from a land whale collision earlier this morning. Land whales, they can't drive. You know, my sister married one of them little whores last year. Now every Thanksgiving I have to spend with his blood clot rise. Last night was an enormous mistake, Mark. Expect no special treatment just because you've seen my cooch. And a good morning to you, too. Callie, who are you talking to about your cooch? I said, scooch. Tape. Scooch tape, sir. It's maintenance. Get me my scooch tape, maggot! Granted, not the most nurturing relationship, but the way I figure, if you like it normal, why bother coming to New York? Hey, buddy, maybe a diaper here? Suck my balls. Yeah, I hear that's good luck. OK, people, eyes up front. Not you, three eyes. We've all heard about cutbacks. Here's how it breaks down. We're going to borrow just a tad from social services in order to fully fund law enforcement. Uh, where is the other bar? I know. It's really hard to make that visible. There you are. Questions? Do I still have a job? No. <laughs> other questions? Good. Then Lieutenant Grimes, round up 20 illegals by day's end and our office wins a bonus ham. Illegals are the disease, and I'm the cure, sir. Um, excuse me, but aren't quota systems illegal? Who is he again? Mark Lilly, sir, from Social Services. Our token bleeding heart. Don't want to make waves here. I just thought we were supposed to be helping new citizens assimilate, not treating them like criminals. No, I I'm Mark clapping. As am I. No, you aren't. You're going for that slow building applause thing, like all those 80s movies. There's virtually no difference in our class. Stop clapping, both of you. You rubber stamp immigrants into the workforce. Grimes sends them back where they came from. Did I miss something? No, sir. Sound logic. <laughs>